In this video, we'll find the oxidation numbers for each element in P2O3 and then in P4O6. And the thing is, P2O3 doesn't really exist in this form. It's always found as P4O6. But let's find the oxidation numbers for each element for these just anyway. So oxygen, that's going to be negative 2, except with a few exceptions. So we'll have negative 2 for this oxygen here, this oxygen negative 2 as well. So we have three oxygens, each one is negative 2 here. The phosphorus, we don't really know that from our rules, so we have to look at the oxygen. And the whole compound needs to have the oxidation numbers add up to 0. 3 times negative 2, that's negative 6. So 2 times some number, that'll give us positive 6, and everything adds up to 0. 2 times positive 3, that's plus 6. Here we have 3 times negative 2, that's negative 6, adds up to 0. These are the oxidation numbers for P2O3. Let's take a look over here. So here we have negative 12, 6 oxygens, each negative 2. 4 times a positive 3, that gives us a positive 12. Add that to the negative 12 here, we get 0. So these are the oxidation numbers for P4O6. And that's really it. The thing you to remember, though, that P4O6, this is the only thing that really does exist. This is Dr. B with the oxidation number for P2O3 and P4O6. Thanks for watching.